Okay, guys, you all know the procedure. Let us always remember to wash our hands before we begin preparing any food items. Now, this is my chicken. It's already prepped. I washed it and I cleaned it up. I used some lemon water. You can also use vinegar if you like. So I drained it and now I'm waiting to put some seasoning on it. Okay guys, now we're gonna season our chicken. I'm gonna be adding my sazonador inside of my chicken. And then I'm gonna be putting some Maggi. And then I'm gonna put some curry powder. Now these, this curry powder, you can get it mild and you can get it really hot if you want it. So you can buy whatever you like. I'm gonna be adding my curry powder on it. Mr. Dash. Some ginger. Now you can put whatever seasoning you wanna use with your curry. I'm gonna add some black pepper. to see and I added some chopped garlic on it so we're gonna rub this up with our scallion and our thyme and we're gonna rub it in okay I added some onions some scallion thyme and also some garlic so we're gonna rub this chicken up rub it up squeeze in the seasoning because you want all that flavors to kick in so we're gonna put it to rest for about five minutes we're gonna cover it and let it rest and then we're gonna preheat our pot with some vegetable oil so we'll be right back all right, guys, before I cover my chicken, I'm gonna be chopping up uh, this hot pepper right here, and I'm gonna put it on the chicken and rub it in so I get that spice. So this is how you're gonna chop it up. You know, so we're gonna rub it in to give it that curry, spicy taste, you know? So you're gonna squeeze it, squeeze it like this. Rub it in. And now we're gonna cover. Okay guys, our pot is ready, our oil is ready. And in Jamaica, it's our tradition to pour some of the curry powder in the hot oil. And they say that we do this, well, we do this because we don't want to have diarrhea. So this is why Jamaicans burn their curry but you're not going to burn it for it to be black 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 because if you make it get black it's going to taste too bitter and you don't want your curry to be bitter so you pour it in and it's going to come around and let it stay a little bit now we're going to toss our chicken in and then we're gonna stir it around. So we're gonna stir it around for it to catch that curry color that you just poured in there. Stir it, and then you're gonna cover to simmer a little bit. Okay, guys. This is all the juice that our chicken produce. Uh, Sometimes you may not get so many juice from a chicken, so you can add a little water, but thank God mine produces all this water. So our Irish potato is tender, our chicken is tender, it's ready to go. So we're gonna add in all our veggies. All our veggies, we're gonna add them in. We're gonna stir. 
stir and we're gonna leave like maybe about five minutes because i don't like when my vegetables are too soft i like when they're crunchy so you're just gonna cover it and let it soak in to give that chicken that flavor Delicious curry chicken. Mm. Delicious curry chicken.